In this video, I'm going to show you how you can speed up or slow down videos in Premiere Pro. Hey guys, my name is Scott and I make full and mini tutorials like this one on Premiere Pro, Photoshop, and freelancing tips. So please do consider hitting the subscribe button and hitting the notification bell if you don't want to miss any of those. Okay, let's get into how we can speed up or slow down videos in Premiere. First, we're going to start off with how to speed up a clip. So I have a video here of a bike rider in San Francisco near the Golden Gate Bridge. So he's riding by the camera, but the clip appears to be playing back slower than I want. So I'm going to right click on the clip and then I'm going to go to speed slash duration. And when I click on that, a dialog box should pop up with a percentage of how fast the clip is playing. So right now it's playing at 100% of its original speed. Now if I want to speed up the clip, I'll need to increase the percentage. Since the bike rider was moving pretty slow, I'm going to increase the speed from 100 to 400%. Now if we play back the clip, it looks like it's playing back at what its normal speed was in real life when it was originally filmed. But if we want to make the bike rider go even faster, we can just go back to speed duration and increase the percentage once more. This time I'll change it to 800%. Now when we play it back once again, the bike rider is moving super fast. Next let's take a look at how we can slow down some footage and it's pretty similar to how we sped up the other clip. You can just go and right click on the clip, go to speed duration, and then decrease the percentage to lower than 100% to slow down the speed. However, there's a problem that you can run into with slowing down clips, and it has to do with frame rate. Frame rate is important because depending on how many frames your clip has, will determine how smooth the slow motion playback will appear. If your clip only has say 23 to 30 frames per second, when you slow it down, it's going to look really choppy. You can check your clip's frame rate by going to your project window and looking for the frame rate info box. You can also right click on your source clip, go to properties, and an information box should pop up with all the clip's info. On the other hand, if your clip has close to 60 frames per second, like this clip with some birds hanging out, it's going to play back much smoother at 50%. And that's because there's more than twice as many frames in this bird clip, which has 59.94 frames per second, than this bike rider clip, which only has 25 frames per second. In other words, the bird clip has way more frames to work with in slow motion, which creates a much smoother playback. So my advice to you guys is, if you're working with a video clip that's around 23 to 30 frames per second, try to stay above 75% when slowing down the footage. That way, you'll still be able to get a slowed down look without it appearing too choppy. And if you're really going for that super nice, smooth, slow motion look, make sure you shoot your video at 60 frames per second. That way, you don't run into this issue when you're editing everything together. So that's how you can speed up or slow down videos in Premiere Pro. How will you guys use the speed up or slow down effects with your videos? Let me know in the comments below. If you've enjoyed this video, please hit the like button and don't forget to share this with anyone else who might also enjoy it. For more information on Premiere Pro, Photoshop, and freelancing tips, head over to my website at scottedwardfowler.com. Also, check out my other tutorials which I've posted on the right side of the screen here. Alright, that's it for me guys, see you in the next video.